I have for years had kind of a, a negative emotions about football. Uh, when I was younger, I hated everything to do with it. And it comes from, I, I was a nerd. Nerds and jocks are like polar opposites. And I was stuck in the stereotype of being a nerd. And it was just, I hated football for that reason. Stupid dog interrupted this. Man, the dude's growling a lot. Anyway. Anyway, that's uh, that's a lesson. And I've grown up a bit, become wiser. A little bit. A little bit wiser. And. Stop it! No longer do I hate everything about. Okay, you're making this impossible. I'm trying to record here. <laughs> Maybe I should just switch this up to a, a, a vlog about Jake. See, see, can you see him down there? Stupid little thing. But, I mean, he's my friend, but he's just... I, I want to vlog about football, though. I want to talk about, about how it's silly it is and how... As I've grown up, I... Oh, it's because another dog's in the yard. Great. How... <laughs> it's so hard to do. As I gr have grown up, I've come to see that being a really avid football fan is, is like the nerdy equivalent of LARPing, live action role play. And when when a nerd dresses up in a costume and starts uh, reenacting battles and s stuff like that, really like Dungeons and Dragons, live action, you know, like getting up and swinging your fake swords and stuff like that. And here's why. Here's why. Because whoa, because uh, the sports fan. Dresses up in a t-shirt that has someone else's name and number on the back, paints their face, goes around screaming like an idiot. And, um, for what? And if, okay, if, uh, this guy that they've never met, this guy on some team they've never actually even met, doesn't score... They're bummed out. They ride in the streets and because they lost. But then if this if the same guy, okay, during game, say he wins, he throws a thousand free throw points or whatever touchdowns. He scores a whole bunch of touchdowns and they win. Um, this guy walks around and he goes. Oh, we kicked your boss! And I just, I just laugh. It's really silly because I look at this guy and I say, or in my head, I, I usually don't confront people, but I, I think, you know, you sat your fat butt on a couch and ate a burrito. You had nothing to do with that game. And yet... The fan will take credit and say, Our team won! Yeah, it's not your team. It's just somebody you cheered for. You better take this dog in and you know, sleep for a few hours. Right? First time you get up. Crazy dog.